Howdy YouTube, this is Steven, and I'm back with another lyrical analysis. This time, I'll be analyzing the song, Automatic Part 2, by Utada Hikaru. And this song comes from Utada's album entitled, This Is The One. And this song wasn't a single, it doesn't have a music video, but it has a you know, an interesting sound with it. And, you know, I was just like, hey, why not do a lyrical analysis of it? So, here we go. <clears throat> Alright, so. Alright, here we go. Hello, my name is Utada. Like, la di da di da di da. Alright, so right off the bat, Utada is introducing herself to us. However, I think it's a bit late with introductions because. You know, even the song itself is a supposed to be a continuation of her song Automatic from I don't know which era it's from. I'm to be keep it real, I'm not totally familiar with uh Utara Hikaru's discography, but I know this song is a continuation for the simple fact that it says part two, and plus I remember seeing it somewhere. <clears throat> so right there I'm like, alright. This song is part two. And this album is your second English English language album. So why uh, it's a bit late with introductions, Utada. You got to. Right. If they listening, they know who you are by now. You know. This should have been on like um Exodus. Or either at the very least this song should have been the first song on the album This Is the One. But it's not. You know? <clears throat> so yeah and we know who you are so she's saying hello my name is Utada like la di da di da 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 and I'm like Utada does not sound like la di da di da 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 no it sounds like Utada not la di da if I said oh um hello this is Steven, and I'm back with another lyrical analysis. This time I'll be analyzing the song by La Di Da Di Da Di Da Da called Automatic Part 2. I'm pretty sure the Utada Tots will be like, her name's not La Di Da Di Da Da Da. It's Utada Hikaru. You know what I'm saying? So no. Uh, your name is not La Di Da Di Da 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 Da. <clears throat> Alright, let's see what else she's saying in the song. For your information, I'm here to take it higher. Do you like it? Do you like the way I shine like freshly cut sapphire? Okay, so she's doing a little rhyme scheme here. All right. I'll give her some kudos for that. Um, but she's saying that she wants to take it higher. What's it? You know, I guess she want to, I guess, take her game higher, you know, or either take the game higher. I'm not sure. But she wants to take something higher and... She's asking us, do she do we like the way that she shines like freshly cut sapphire? <clears throat> and eh, it's okay. You know? <clears throat> Next lyrics. Music is my business and I'm here to pour it on ya. So okay, she's saying music is her business. Obviously, of course, you know, we all know that. You know, Utara Ikaru is um a musical artist <clears throat> and she's here to pour it on us but wouldn't that metaphor have been better put as probably I'm here to put it on you right because pouring is associated with drinks so she's like I'm a bartender and I'm here to pour it on you then okay I'm getting you I, you know I'll get that <clears throat> but, uh, right here it's a little odd there but I'm gonna be nice and I'm gonna let Utada slide you know I won't let you slide with that one <clears throat> Next lyrics. When I like it, I don't hide it. Got to have it. All right. So basically, she's saying like, you know, when she like, you know, it's pretty self-explanatory. But you know, when she feeling it, you know, she can't hide it. She don't hide it. She don't try to hide it. She gotta have it. You know, <clears throat> I can't help it. It's automatic. It's automatic. All right. <clears throat> Bright and ready, call me crazy. Got to love it. 
So she like she ready. You know. And she loves it. And you know it's automatic. It's automatic. What type of car you got, Hutana? It's automatic. What? It's automatic. Who? I can't help it. It's automatic. It's automatic. I'm like, all right. All right. We know that you drive an automatic car now, Utana. You know? I'm, you know, she ain't she ain't down with the manual shit. She ain't down with um the manuals. <clears throat> cars, you know, no stick shift cars for her. It's automatic. And that's the only type of car that Utada drives. And, you know, I can't knock her for that, you know. I feel so on that. <clears throat> but they say that, you know, manual cars get better um, gas mileage. You know, they, I think they use less gas than automatics. So, that would be an incentive for someone to want to drive a manual shift car. <clears throat> Next lyrics. When I like it, I don't hide it. It's automatic, it's automatic, it's automatic. So it's safe to say that Utara Hikaru likes her cars to be automatics. <clears throat> Alright, next. Lyrics. When I see a microphone, I got to get on it. Alright, so Utara, she likes, you know, she got the music in her. You know, she... Cause she, you know she's a singer, so she like when I see the mic, I got to get on it. So like, yep, I got a mic, and ooh, ooh yeah, I see you. Ooh, 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 ooh. So when she see a mic, she got to get her sang on, and I sort of kind of feel on that, <clears throat> cause you know you got to get your same. But enough of that. All right, back to business. Capricorn, Aquarius. What a good sense of humor. So these um signs here have good sense. Uh, have a good sense of humor. And you know, I'm not really into astrology, so I don't know. <clears throat> I think it's kind of BS, to be honest. It's entertaining BS, but ultimately it's BS, in my opinion. Because from what I heard, um, I took a class in astronomy, and my professor said that really the astrological signs change over time. Because I guess like the planets aren't always aligned the same, or however they do it, it kind of changes throughout time. So you were born in, say... Um, <coughs> like January or February or like around that area then it's like okay um they say you're an Aquarius but because things have changed so much you know everything shift because it shifts and moves you could be say a Sagittarius or a Capricorn you know <clears throat> so ultimately it's BS because it changes you know, it like the astrological signs change. It's hard to ex explain because I don't quite know how to explain it. Um, but I do know that ultimately the signs were not set in stone for each month. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. <clears throat> but hey, you know, if you... Um, are interested in the subject definitely google it hey feel free to educate me <clears throat> next lyrics find out more about me on myspace in my newsletter all right so obviously this song was probably written when my might you know myspace was still popping <clears throat> in her newsletter you know i'm pretty sure her newsletter is kind of on hiatus as well since utana has been on hiatus for Wow. <clears throat> Next lyrics. I'll be glad to add you, but I won't give you my number. Okay. You know, I don't blame Utana there. Can't be giving out your number to random mofos on the internet. You know, how that how that's going to work? Having random people call your phone at random hours. Yeah, right. Alright, next lyrics. 
philanthropic. Okay, so, you know, Lieutenant likes to do charitable work. All right, all right now. All right. wonder what charities she supports. <clears throat> Diabolic. All right, so it sounds like she into that Illuminati stuff, that alumni association stuff. Hopefully, hopefully not. Hopefully she done backed away from that. You know, fingers crossed. So melodic. All right, melodic. <clears throat> All right, so yeah, you should be melodic. You're a singer. Next lyrics. I can't help it. It's automatic. So all this stuff that she is doing is automatic. Baca tonic. Okay, so it sounds like Uta likes to get her drink drink on. You know? <clears throat> Cali Funky. I'm not quite sure what that means, but I'm guessing maybe a combination of California and Funky. Contraceptive. Alright, so it sounds like Uta, you know, she ain't trying to get pregnant anytime soon. So, you know, I feel so on that. <clears throat> when I'm on it, it's automatic. So when she's on all this stuff, Cali Funky, Bacatonic, Contraceptives, it's automatic. It's automatic. <clears throat> it's automatic. It's automatic. I can't help it. It's automatic. It's automatic. When I like it, I don't hide it. It's automatic. It's automatic. It's automatic. And I just want, you know, just let me speed this up a little bit because, you know, I'll tell you, how many times does she say it's automatic in the song? Let me just, you know, bring this. I'll get back to that in a second, but let me move on to the next lyrics. <clears throat> Indian Pacific, Arctic, and Atlantic Ocean. You can be my captain and I'll be your commander. So she's, you know, shouting out all these different oceans and stuff, you know. Shout out to the Indian Ocean. What, what? You know, shout out to Pacific. What? And Arctic, keep it cool. And Atlantic, what? And, you know, now she's saying she can be the captain and um, the commander. Well, whoever can be captain, she can be commander. No, she can be the captain. And, you know, no, I mean, sorry, y'all. You can be my captain and I'll be your commander. There you go. <clears throat> you like the way I rhyme. It's pretty darn clever. And I hear, I've heard better from you. I'm going to keep it real. Let's see. Were there any clever rhymes in this song? I say, you know, um, I say that the first part of the song where it's like, you know, do you like the way I shine like freshly cut sapphire? I kind of like that part where it's like, I'm here to take you higher. Do you like the way I shine like freshly cut sapphire? I'll give her that one. All right. <clears throat> Next lyrics. Used to be a version. Now I'm with Island Death Jam. I'm pretty sure um, that whole version thing went out the window long before she signed with Island Death Jam. You know, <clears throat> but I think she was with a record label called Version Records or something like that. So there you go. <clears throat> All right. Next lyrics up in here. It's automatic. What? It's automatic. Who? It's automatic. What type of car it is? It's automatic. Are you sure? Yep, it's automatic. All right now. It's automatic. Yeah, you don't like manuals? Nope. It's automatic. And that's the end of the song. <clears throat> All right. So let's count up how many times she done said automatic. All right, it's automatic. One and another. All right. So one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five. I'm counting twenty-five. I may have missed something. You know, there's probably a part in the song which they didn't put in the lyrics at the very beginning when she says something automatic so it might be 26 you know but you know in the mid 20s let's say that <clears throat> so she has said this phrase over 20 times in a song that's about three minutes I think this song 
Yeah, about three minutes. Hmm. That's interesting. That is very, very interesting, Utana. <clears throat> but, um, let's see. What else can I say? This song doesn't have a music video, but I can imagine a music video for this song. So let me imagine one. Okay, so we have Utada, and she's like in a stretch limousine. And she got like acting like a rapper or something. Like, it's automatic. It's automatic. And then she's like, I'm here to pour it on you. Yeah. And then she got some like, you know, vodka tonic or some, you know, drink, drink in the limo. And, um, she probably got some, you know, groupies in the limo too. <clears throat> and they're driving, you know, throughout the city, going to different places and clubs and stuff. And, you know, they're probably going to like, you know, a strip club at one point. Then maybe go to a club with, um, you know, a majority black population in the club. And then the club where it's like, um, the majority white folk perhaps. Then a, a club where it's like, oh, it's a um, club for gay people. So she's going to different clubs, you know, different types of clubs throughout the night. You know, she club hopping, you know, in a limousine, a stretch limousine. So there you go. <clears throat> and let's see. You know, this song has sort of like a hip hop vibe with it. And, you know, I appreciate Utada doing something a little different there. That's different for her, for her, as far as I know, because I think she's more like it, probably like R and B type of vibe. <clears throat> um, so yeah, it's something different, and I'll give Utada some credit for that one. It's automatic, um, but yeah, it's a decent song. It's a respectable song. She probably would get some airplay in the United States with this song. So good job, Utada. Good job. This probably should have been released as a single, <clears throat> but I can understand why she wouldn't want to be want it to be released as a single because then some people might, you know, her fans, you know, her core base might be like, "Oh, you selling out," you know, you know how you know fans do, some, you know, artists they like, they really put them under a microscope sometimes. I'm like, "Oh, you know, can't do this," you know. I hope you don't do that. You shouldn't do that, but. It's, it's okay to try new things, you know. But I said all I have to say for the time being. So thanks a lot for watching. Feel free to comment. Feel free to subscribe. Feel free to give me a thumbs up. Your feedback and your support is extremely appreciated and extremely valued. <clears throat> so until the next lyrical analysis video, adios and goodbye for now. Ch -ch 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 -ch. I hope when you comment, it's automatic. When you subscribe, it's automatic. When you thumbs up, it's automatic. Yeah, it's automatic. Ooh, it's automatic. I hope your support is automatic. Yeah, automatic. Oh. Again, thanks a lot for watching. Adios and goodbye for now.